Hi, I'm Paul Sculthorpe. I'm here today at Eccleston Court to launch the St. Helens Rugby League Club Reminiscence Area. And these are my five quick fire questions. My very first memory of rugby would be growing up as a, as a, as a, as a child in, uh, in Oldham. My, my old man played rugby league, uh, so I used to go watching him. And then I, I started as, a, as an eight-year-old uh, team called Rotten Tigers. Uh, and from that very first training session in the Army, I was, uh, I was made for rugby league. As a rugby player, I think honest. Um, you know, obviously skillful and, and talented. Um, I think the, I think dedicated probably is, is the biggest one. Um, you know, dedicated and disciplined to, to be the best that I could be in, in my profession. Dedicated, definitely. Um, I like to think tough, but not just physically, but you know, mentally as well. Um, and you know, team player. We scored in the, in the last second of the game, I mean, it, it ran into overtime. Uh, Chris Joint scored, and that took us to the grand final. Um, I remember everybody diving on the, the, the mascot of Dovon as well, and Sean Long, who <laughs> I've got many stories about, <laughs> he, uh, he stole St Bernard's head and thought he could kick the goal with St Bernard's head on. Oh, which uh, unfortunately Russell Smith, the referee, wouldn't have. <laughs> but the, the game was won, and uh, yeah, it was just a funny moment seeing Longy running back to, with the kicking tee with a giant St. Bernard's head on. <laughs> My proudest moment for St. Helens, I'd have to say, probably the 2004 Challenge Cup final. We, uh, we beat Wigan at uh, a full stadium at, at Cardiff, at the Millennium Stadium, and that was my first one as, as captain of Saints, picking up the, the Challenge Cup. You know, I'd grown up as a, as a child watching, you know, legends pick that trophy up and, and be involved in, in them, you know, cup winning finals, and that for me was probably the, the highlight of my career.